Welcome to Max. Now I know a lot of businesses have very complicated, world-conquering business purposes, but actually our purpose is really simple, to ensure that generations can rely on Max. And when we talk about generations, we don't just mean generations of a family, but generations of our guests, our team members, our suppliers, our business partners, and even the treasury. So how do we ensure that we continue to meet this business purpose? Well, we have a couple of really key characteristics. First of all, is the desire to succeed. And for that, I'll take you all the way back to the founding of our business. Peter McMullen, one of 11 children, had been apprenticed off by his father as a cooper and maker of barrels. However, within four years, he'd been fired for neglect and bad behavior. So life was not looking so good for him. But fortunately, he married a wonderful lady called Sarah Manning, who helped to steady him up. Not so much so that by 1827, he was brewing beer merrily in the back of his father's house and illegally selling it out the front. Fortunately for him and us, by 1830, the Beer House Act allowed anybody on the payment of a couple of guineas to the local magistrate to tell their beer to the public. And so our business went legitimate. It turns out he's pretty good at this. And by 1833, he's developed his first product, AK, which we continue to brew today. And it's one of the longest standing continually brewed beer brands in the country. And by 1836, he decides he's gonna buy the Greyhound pub up in Bengio, our first pub. There's also a lovely characteristic called grit. And this has been extremely important to our business over the ages. The fact is we have survived eight recessions and three great depressions. And there's another moment in our history where pure determination has held the business together to the benefit of all. And that was a time just after the Second World War when Osmond Mullen dies. Unbeknown to us, the tax law has changed and revenue try raising inheritance tax on the business at 163%. So the family decide to fight, and they decide to sacrifice the family home, the carpets, the curtains, all the furniture, in order to keep the business going. So grit not only ensures our continuing survival, but is the basis of our desire to see our business and the people within it succeed. As a result, we continue to invest through good and tougher times in our team members in meeting their career aspirations to ensure that they can rely on our business now and for all generations. Now if all this sounds of interest to you, welcome to Max.